Hello everyone, I am Ponsa Khalani. I'm a Master of Commerce and Financial Management candidate at Rhodes University. The title of my thesis is The Moderating Effect of Socioeconomic Factors on the Relationship Between Financial Inclusion and Poverty Among South African Vulnerable Households. Now I'm sure we've all heard of or at least even experienced uh, people losing their money to Ponzi schemes that promise high unprecedented returns after just a few months of investing. We also know of loan sharks within our community that offer credit or loans to people at unreasonably high interest rates and how when people are unable to pay back that money, then loan sharks confiscate people's property and assets. These are just some of the challenges that vulnerable households in South Africa face due to not being able to have access to formal and regulated financial products and services. Now, the formal financial sector is tasked or expected to promote access to regulated financial products and services to all segments of the society at affordable and reasonable terms and conditions, and this is known as financial inclusion. Both financial inclusion and the level of household poverty are driven or affected by different, different factors such as the highest level of education attained, employment status, race, gender and even age. Collectively, these factors are known as socioeconomic factors. Now what my research proposes to do is to determine the relationship between having access to four financial products and services and the level of household poverty within South African vulnerable households. These four products and services are access to a bank account, access to insurance, access to savings, and access to credit. I will then determine whether having at least access to two or more of these financial products and services affects the level of household um, poverty within South African vulnerable households. Additionally, I will determine whether the socioeconomic status of households affects this relationship between financial inclusion and poverty. My study is important because any adverse event that may occur, such as COVID-19, will further push um, vulnerable households into poverty. Additionally, it is important to advise or inform um, the financial, the formal financial sector on how to promote access to formal financial products and services to all segments of um, the society, especially vulnerable households within South Africa. Thank you.